gonna go for a walk. Now, as you can see, at the top of the ball pen, ballpoint pen, there is a ball there. Very small it is. So, when you write with this, the ball rotates. And when the ball rotates, the ink here, from eh, the ink from here, it reaches there because of the gravity. Now, when we do write upside down, the gravity is not there. So, that means that is why the we are not able to ride with the right as you had done so that is why we are able to write so when you write like this you can but when you write upside down you can't understood yes
is trying to maintain its inertia but when we shake a bottle so rapid shaking like this with this so it makes the sauce the liquid to come out but actually it is trying to maintain its inertia and when we shake it a lot so it a lot so its inertia is then gone and it has to come out okay mom i'm going to sleep because i'm so sleepy mm -hmm. okay mom i'm going to sleep You go to sleep. so as you all can see that this is actually a concept of physics when a light source so from a light source when its uh, light rays if uh, they are diverging so when we somehow make them again meet at the point it forms a image so what is a image when the light rays meet at another point if somehow we make it to meet at another point it forms the image so this is actually the image as you can see now what happens is that if there is a object light source there so what will happen the light from it will come like this and it will go in a retina and the our eye lens it converges it so it makes it meet at a point and forms the image in our retina so this is let's say our situation 1 what happens in the situation 2 For understanding situation two, let us first understand what happens when light source is hit by a, a rough surface. So when it is hit by a rough surface, uh, surface it actually uh, go here and there, here and there. So there is no particular pattern to it. It is actually uh, reflected by the rough surface in all the directions. but when there is a plain surface like the mirror so in the mirror if the light source is here so light will come at a particular angle and it will also be reflected at a particular angle okay actually in this diagram it is not like this actually when the angle of the ray this is coming so it will again be reflected parallel if uh, it will again be reflected in this direction so in the rough surface it will go here and there here and there right in the mirror in the case of mirror this is the particular thing which is going to happen i hope this is clear so so what happens is let's say there is a light source and the light from it is reflected by the mirror at a particular angle now it comes to the eyes if a human eye and it then forms the image in the retina now as you can see that our brain what it thinks it thinks that the that light is coming from a straight source so it will be the image will be the image must be here be behind the mirror and actually that is a virtual image it is not there but our brain is tricked so our brain can't differentiate between situation 1 and situation 2 it thinks that the Im the image is behind the mirror but actually it is not now i hope it is clear right yes you know that 
when our hand to okay, give i'm talking about our hand when our hand if we will get uh, injured at this part let us say i hit my this part here so you get an electric shock do you know why because here is our unprotected nerve now the nerve carries the electric city you can say in a very small amount so when we hit this part actually the, that nerve is blocked and the electricity which is coming from our brain and all the parts of our body it gets uh, stopped there and it accumulates there and gives an electric shock and there are so many other facts about the human body actually when we uh, uh, dip our hands or fingers in the water for a long time it will form very rough surface on the fingers right after taking a long bath we see this now this is because of our intelligent body this happens because uh, when we take uh, when the water touches our fingers so water doesn't have any friction it has very low friction so our fingers can lose its grip right so if we will uh, keep our fingers in the water for a long time it will lose its grip so for making the grip our brain makes the finger it gives the rough surface to the finger so that we can hold the things there are so many other facts as well if we will take all the dna of an average adult and lie them straight in a line it will cover the distance between the earth and the sun 600 times Oh my god. And do you know what is the distance between earth and the sun? No. 150 million kilometers it is. Oh around. my god. You see science is there in our day to day life. The DNA, the full form of DNA is deoxyribonucleic acid. There is acid. Chemistry is there in our body. The things which we see around, light, sound, and all of these, uh, all of the these things, they are physics, uh, applications of physics. So science is there in our day-to-day -day life. We are just surrounded by the science. The thing is to see the science and find it out. Now I understand. Okay, so now let's get back to the work. Yes. Okay, bye. Bye.